Welcome back, game fans, to Super Mario All-Stars, uh, episode two? Yes. So last time we left on World 2 on Super Mario Brothers 2, so we're going to dive right back in. We're going to grab Mario, and we're going to go right at it. Here we go. Good old Mario. And not a whole lot this guy does different. His jump is just a jump. He's a little faster at grabbing. Like I said, we'll check this out together, though. I'm sure how to do this. Okay, well. Maybe I was supposed to take the turtle shell out. I don't know. Oop. Not good as idea as any. Oh, there is that. Okay, we can jump on the quicksand. Like as long as oop, got hit. Oh man. At least the cactus won't hurt you. At least this cactus won't. Well his super throw isn't awful. Her su his super jump, it's a little higher. Okay, cool. A little higher than Princess Peach, but... Okay, we're gonna dig, so we're gonna throw this guy away. And yeah, we're gonna dig down. this. Yeah, watch this guy dig. He's just, like, super fast. Oh, he's probably a little faster than Mario. Not much. I don't know if you can hear my button clicking, but I am mashing the heck out of that thing. Come on, Toad. Don't get shot, dude. Don't get shot. Ladder, sweet. Ah, oh, I was almost there with Mario. That makes it even worse. Birdo music. Oh man, if you right, then you can't pick Birdo up. You gotta be quick, because I mean, if you're too slow, you could ride off into the pit there. Give me an egg so I can smack you in the face with it. Thank you. Team player. That's what it's all about. Teamwork. Yo. Nope. Let's try it again. <gasps> Two up. Sweet. Let's go with Luigi so you can check out how he works. And he does that little run thing, and it's a little weird, but he floats like the whole time. His jump is just ridiculously high. Um, you gotta be honest, he's a little hard to control because of that. Not impossible, though. Like, I'm gonna take away from my boy Luigi here, but, uh,. A lot of people just didn't like him. It's not his fault he was a... Oh, I just caught the thing I threw. That was cool. I saw a video once where a guy uh, was playing this game and he threw... Oops. Oh, goodness. Um, okay. Take it. 
Anyway, he throws the uh, the fruit or whatever at the at the guys, and uh, it bounced off of him, and he caught the fruit again. Like he was just decimating like everybody in I don't even know what this kingdom's called. Dreamland. Uh oh. Oh, wow. I don't know how I survived that, but I did. Because of Luigi's awesome jumping skills. Now, well, Luigi digs about as fast as the princess, which doesn't say a lot for our boy here. You know, just dig like a girl, Luigi. It's like, oh, Mario, come on. Why are you always gonna pick on me? Nobody likes you, Luigi. That's not true. Luigi had one of my uh, most favorite GameCube games, and that's uh, uh, Luigi's Mansion. Um, in that, oh, Luigi here gets a letter and says that he's won or inherited a mansion. And he's all like, okay, sure. And he goes, and it's uh, haunted. And you meet a professor that, or a mad scientist that helps you... Uh, um, capture ghosts. And of course, Luigi's scared to death of ghosts, so... Alright, can I jump up here? No, I can't. Hmm. Oh no, Luigi. Yeah, his jumping's just way too hard for me. We'll go with my girl. Like I said, the floating aspect of her, being able just to float in the air and have that much more control over your jumps, because that's what Mario really boils down to, is controlling the jumps. If you can control the jumps, you beat the game. And that's any Mario game. I didn't find any coins, no secrets. Man, that was a fail. But I gotta be honest, I, I don't remember a lot of this, so we're going into unknown territory here. I should have waited to get those. Oh, never mind. I thought maybe you could jump over the top there. Mushroom? No? Yeah, we'll get some coins at the very least. Dang it. That's how Princess Roll. Oh. Oh, that was close. <laughs> oh, man. It's got to be one of these, right? Okay. There it is. Nice. We needed that. I'm going to have lots of coins for the, uh, for the, the box. Let's get another power up. So, I keep waiting to uh, fly, <laughs> uh, you know, because if you run really fast for a, 
oh goodness, for a long time in any Mario game, except for one or two, you fly. Uh, N64. How do we feel about N64 games? Uh, would you guys like to see some gameplay of that? I really asked about that. I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, I sure so, definitely did. Ugh. More digging. Shut him up. Bam. One more time? I don't know. He might hang up. Here we go. No, I got him. Okay, good. <laughs> I thought he might hang up on that next level of sand or whatever. Dig like your life depended on a princess. I don't know, think about it. Going down kind of sucks. Going up's going to be hard. Because you can't really see above you. And of course, you got to carry the key, so. Run. Okay, so we may get to fight Birdo with a star. That'd be awesome. Let's see if we can. Here we go. Oh, it's not a Birdo level. It's just a Beat It level. That's okay. Oh, no, it is. It's the last level. That's right. This is it. There we go. All right, guys. I'll do our normal wrap up right here. I'll go ahead and grab all the extra lives I can do. Uh, we'll do our normal save at that one spot and um, dive into the next part as soon as I save. This, this is going to come in handy, I'll tell you what. Um, woo, that was cool. Ah, dang it. Come on. That was fun. Like... You actually win some... Oh, oh, yeah. Two one-ups. Man, I got 19 lives. Alright, that's it. Okay, here we are. We're gonna go ahead and grab Princess Peach. That way I can save into World 3-1. So, we're gonna start off the next time. Until next time, game on, friends, and bye-bye.